To be a student in Trakia University, it is an interesting and um, uh, exciting experience. First, Stara Zagora is a very old town. It's one of the oldest towns in the country and even in the Balkan Peninsula. It, uh, the first stay, uh, stay settlements are from the 4,000 years ago, from the Neolith periods. And also there is a very strong history during the years from the Thracian period, from the Roman period. After that we have a, um, a set history during the Osmanic uh, rule, ruling. And nowadays the town is beautiful, it is uh, shiny, it is the town of the Linden, it is the town of the mountain, of the poets. It is a beautiful town and this is the first thing that attracts the people generally in Stara Zagora. It is a calm town, it is a not very big town, at the same time it is university town. The Trakia University, it is uh, one uh, multidisciplinary university. It, we have uh, six or seven faculties in different subjects medical faculty, veterinary medicine faculty, agriculture faculty, um, faculty of pedagogy, uh, technical faculty which is in, set out in Yambu, uh, medical college and um, faculty or um, in the Haskovo which also is dealing with the medical, uh, with uh, nursing and uh, midwife, other type of uh, medical uh, social workers. The medical faculty, which I am a representer because I am the Vice Dean in the Educational uh, Affairs. My name is Tatiana Vlajkova, I am Professor in Biochemistry. The medical faculty, it's not very big faculty, but we have a lot of uh, subjects that we are teaching. We are teaching medical students in medicine, we are uh, teaching students in the nursing, in uh, kinesiotherapy, also um, medical assistance, um, social medicine, social workers and several other subjects and several other specialties in our faculty. We have many uh, students from Bulgaria and from other countries. Some, uh, mainly the foreigner students are from the medicine, from the subjects of medicine, from the specialty of medicine, and we have students from many different countries. Besides the most common UK, Greece and Germany, there are students from Finland, from Sweden, from Ireland, from uh, Nigeria, from Egypt, from India and other countries that even don't know all of them quite many different, from Spain also, from many different countries. I Italian students are also, during the last year, students of our faculty. Why uh, you have to study or why the student choose medical faculty of Stars Agora? This that we are not very big uh, faculty, it is one um, advantage because the contacts between the students and the teachers. The students from the different grades are much more tight. They are much more closer. Because when you have not too many students, you have chance to be more commonly in touch with the students. You're um, able to, to, to speak with them much more uh, freely and uh, to meet the students, even not only during the classes, but also in the corridors, in the cafes, in the laboratories, in the research. You can, uh, we can um, uh, recruit our students also in the research groups, in our research teams. So this is the advantage of the small fa faculty because comparing to Plovdiv, Varna, Sofia, we're small faculty and we ha have much smaller number of students, but this is advantage, I guess. To be a medical student, uh, it is a difficult uh, job. Medicine is a very difficult subject. Medicine requires a lot of efforts. Medicine requires determination. 
you have to be really sure that you want to study medicine because it requires a lot of efforts, a lot of um, energy, a lot of time that you spend on the books, on the classes, preparing the, the classes. The students must be with some basic biological and chemical knowledge. This is something which is really a requirement for the students in medicine. Because if you have no idea about the biology of the body, biology generally, it is extremely difficult to study further biomedical sciences, especially medicine. But also, the students should be really, uh, want, they should want to, to become good doctors. They have to experience sympathy to the people, otherwise it's not, it's not possible to be a good doctor. All students which graduate in medicine, I could say they find their uh, they place under the sun. Because all uh, students which graduate in the Bulgarian medical universities, including also the medical faculty of Trakia University, their diplomas are recognized, they are considered in the all European countries, including in the UK, and also in Turkey, without additional examination, they can continue working and they can start working in their universities, in their hospitals, in their medical centers without any additional efforts, without any additional uh, exams. This is for the Europe and for the, some of the outside of the European countries uh, like uh, Turkey and UK. Uh, and something uh, which I can also um, share this is the experience of our students, international students, that have already graduated. We still keep in touch with them. I uh, certify a lot of diplomas for many of them which have already found jobs in their countries and I certify their uh, diplomas. This means that they uh, have already found a job and they have already found their future like a medical doctor. So of course, beginning it's always difficult. It is difficult for everyone who graduated something. It's not only medicine. You have to find your um, main uh, idea what you want to, to be. You want to be a surgeon or you want to be the gynecologist or you want to be the pediatrician or whatever it is. But this takes time and you have to specialize, but they can do this because their diplomas are recognized. This is very, very important and that's why so many students from many different countries come to Bulgaria. The students are happy uh, to, sh to say that they have graduated in Bulgaria. I have a friend from, uh, who graduated from the first year in our education. She, in our uh, medical faculty, the first um, uh, year foreigner students, she is in the UK and she said that they were so excited for her knowledge, for her skills, and she is very satisfied of what he, she has learned here. And uh, this is something that I am proud of.